dear students today's topic is study on diseases of brinjal and windy first is diseases of brinjal brinjal is one of the most commonly grown vegetable crops of the country india produces about 7.676 million metric ton of brinjal from an area of 0.472 million hectare with an average productivity of 16.3 metric ton per hectare its production is greatly reduced by many diseases like sarcospora leaf spot alternaria leaf spot bacterial wilt little leaf of brinjal so let's discuss about the fungal diseases first one is the sarcospora leaf spot this disease can be characterized by isochlorotic lesions angular to irregular in shape later turning grayish brown with profuse sporulation at the center of the spot now coming to the scientific classification of this pathogen kingdom is fungi phylum escomycota class dotidiomycetes subclass dotidiomycetidae order capnodials family mycospherulaceae genus sarcospora and species is melongena now coming to the character of the pathogen conidiophores born singly or in fascicles arising from stroma or directly from the vegetative hyphae pale brown septate or non septate which are hyaline to dark brown pigmented continuous simple or branched uniform to clavet sometimes of clavet curved smooth conidia born terminally and singly becoming lateral by sympodial development of the conidiophore acicular to obclavet or cylindrical rarely clavet thin walled multi septet the conidiophore has a sub apical growth reason for the mature conidium to push aside which led to geniculations bearing scars at the area where conidia are detached conidiophore with distinct geniculation that is knee like bands which is an important character for identification due to geniculation conidia are formed singly acrogenously that means at the tip conidia 4 to 10 celled multi septate hyaline or brown conidia conidia measuring 63 to 140 into 14 to 17.5 micron this is about the character of this pathogen next disease is the alternaria leaf spot this disease can be visualized only when spots with distinct concentric rings bands of light and dark colors irregular 4 to 8 mm in diameter and may coalesce to cover large areas of the leaf blade fruits causing large deep seated spots and drop off prematurely now coming to the scientific classification of this pathogen kingdom is fungi class dotidiomycetes subclass pleosporomycetidae order pleosporals family pleosporaceae genus alternaria and species is solani next is the character of the pathogen 
mycelium is septate branch light brown to dark brown it has inter and intracellular conidiophores emerge through stomata and dark colored conidia are single celled muriform conidia with non catenate which means solitary conidia with long filiform beak the conidial septation with 5 to 10 transverse septa and a few longitudinal or oblique septa next important disease is the root rot the disease can be characterized when underground portion that is the root portion causing rot next is the scientific classification of this pathogen kingdom is fungi phylum escomycota class sordariomycetes subclass hypocreomycetidae order hypocreals family nectricae genus fusarium species incarnatum now coming to the character of this pathogen fusarium has a hyaline septate hyphae short conidiophores septation with a terminal phyllite may be simple or branched conidia are formed at effuse sporodokia called pin nodes conidia are of two types microconidia which is single celled oval or comma shape pyriform or elongate and macroconidia which has hyaline spindle shaped with pointed ends it also may have three or more septation distinct pedicellate base macroconidia has a distinct feature of having foot cell macroconidia straight seldom curve three septate 24 into 3.5 micron seven septate 35 to 52.5 micron into 3.5 to 5.2 micron microconidia oval shaped one or two celled thin walled zero septate size is 4 to 6 micron into 2 to 6 micron one septate size is 8 to 20 micron into 2 to 4.5 micron chlamydospores are formed from the hyphae or at macroconidia so this is about the character of this pathogen so next is the bacterial disease first one is the bacterial wilt bacterial disease mostly so wilting stunting yellowing of the foliage and finally collapse of the entire plant are the characteristic symptoms of the disease the vascular system becomes brown bacterial ooze come out from the affected parts now coming to the systematic position of this bacteria domain is bacteria phylum proteobacteria class gamma proteobacteria order pseudomonadales family pseudomonadesi genus pseudomonas now coming to the character of this bacteria the bacterium is non acid first non spore forming non capsulated and motile by a polar flagellum the bacterium produces acid but no gas in dextrose sucrose lactose and glycerol starts hydrolyzed with slight liquefaction of gelatin this is about the character of this pathogen next disease is the little leaf of brinjal peculiar character is infected plants show a bushy appearance 
mostly there is no flowering but if flowers are formed they remain green fruiting is rare now coming to the scientific classification of this pathogen kingdom is bacteria phylum tenericutes class molecules order mycoplasmatelles family mycoplasmatesi genus mycoplasma now let's see the character of this pathogen little leaf was first considered a disease caused by a virus in 1969 it was attributed to a mycoplasma like organism closely related to aster yellows and curly top this organism having ovoid or spherical body this measure 40 to 300 nanometer in diameter and lack a rigid cell wall the phytoplasma are present in phloem sieve tubes it is a sap transmissible disease the organism has been transmitted to datura tomato and tobacco it is occurs in nature on datura next is the diseases of bindi okra popularly known as bindi or lady finger is one of the important vegetables grown throughout the country it is noted for its rich iron content and nutritive value for the commercial cultivation of okra has received a great setback under indian conditions due to attack of different diseases caused by fungal bacteria and virus like powdery mildew wilt leaf spot and yvmb so let's discuss one after another so let's discuss about the fungal diseases first one is the fusarium wilt this disease appears as yellowing and stunting of the plants followed by a wilting and rolling of the leaves and finally the plant dies next is the scientific classification of this pathogen kingdom is fungi division escomycota class sordomycetes order hypocreals family nectriaceae genus fusarium species oxysporum now coming to the character of this pathogen the disease is caused by fusarium oxysporum app species vast infectum the mycelium is hyaline and intracellular in the host macroconidia are mostly three septate and microconidia are 0 to 1 septate the microconidia are 5 to 12 into 2 to 3.5 micrometer while macroconidia are 40 to 50 into 3 to 4.5 micrometer in size macroconidia are fusiform falcate curved and formed on sporodokia and pin nodes in mass these conidia appear buff to solomon orange in color both intercalary and terminal chlamydospores are formed which are broadly ovoid next disease is the sarcospora leaf spot this pathogen produces indefinite leaf spots but grows as a sooty mold on the lower surface of the leaves now coming to the scientific classification of this pathogen kingdom is fungi phylum escomycota class dotidiomycetes order capnodials family mycospirillaceae and genus is the sarcospora now coming to the character of this 
pathogen. The disease is caused by three species of Sarcospora like Sarcospora abelmosi, Sarcospora hibiscina and Sarcospora malayensis. These species differ in their size of conidiophores and conidia. In Sarcospora abelmosi, the conidiophores are long, brown and bear pale olivaceous slightly tapering conidia. The conidiophores of C. hibiscina are extremely long, sometimes up to 1000 micrometer in size, narrow and bare conidia that are sometimes hyaline and appreciably more narrow than those of C. abelmosi. The conidiophores of C. malensis are born in clusters of 5 to 20 and bear conidia which are colorless, narrow, long and tapering from the blunt base to the sharp tip. So this is about the character of this pathogen. Next disease is the powdery mildew. Powdery mildew is an important disease of this crop and under favorable weather condition causes significant yield reductions particularly if the infection takes place at in early stages of plant growth. Produces minute discolored patches with thin fine mesh work of white mycelium arising at many places on the surface of the lower leaves. The conidia after landed on the host surface, germination through the germ tubes elongate and form an apprisorium at the tip in the initial stage of infection. Then the penetration hyphae arise to penetrate the epidermal wall which enters the cell then the bulbous base finger like projections called hosteria arise. Now coming to the scientific classification of this pathogen. Kingdom is fungi, phylum escomycota, class is lutumycetes, subclass lutumycetidae, order erysophiles, family erysophacy, genus erysophy, species Cycore serum. Now coming to the character of this pathogen. The disease is caused by an obligate parasite erysophy Cycore serum. The conidia are single celled, hyaline, barrel shaped and in long chains. The conidial dimensions vary with the physiologic race and the host. Pleistothecia are globose, dark with hyaline to dark brown and mycelate appendages. They contain 8 to 18 SI and the SI are pedicillate, ovate to broadly ovate or ellipsoid. The number of escospores per escus is usually 2, rarely 3. The escospores are one celled and hyaline, oval to sub cylindrical. This is about the character of this pathogen. Next important disease is the yellow vein mosaic. The characteristic symptoms include vein yellowing and thickening of leaves, forming a network of veins and veinlets in the infected leaves. Now let us see the classification of this disease. It is grouped under group 2 single stranded DNA, family Geminiviridae, genus Begomovirus. Now coming to the character of this pathogen. The disease is caused by 
yellow mosaic virus and belongs to the Bizemini virus. The size of virus is 18 into 30 nanometer. Virus particles are spherical, isometric, measuring 28 to 30 nanometer. So now coming to the conclusion of this topic. Brinjal and Bindi is to attack by several diseases such as fungal, bacteria and viruses. Its production is hampered by the several factors like biotic and abiotic factors. So the management of the diseases can be obtained only if we understand about the character of the pathogens and as well as the symptoms involved.